what type of future do you see us as a, as a program? I know you can't look into a crystal ball, but where do you see us going? Where do you see us going as a, I, as a basketball? As a basketball, I mean, as a, as farther than this year, as a basketball program, I think Carolina is going to continue to be great. Um, right. I think we're going to continue to recruit uh, great talent. And I think the biggest step for UNC moving forward is who is going to be Roy's successor? Roy has had an incredible run at UNC, but we know whether we're talking about two years, three years, four years, five years, however, he, at some point, Roy's going to have to step down and pass the torch to somebody. And we have to, who's in the pipeline? Who's going to get that job? That's going to determine if Carolina is going to continue to be successful for the next 30 years. And I think yeah. that we have enough guys in the pipeline uh, that, that that type of thing uh, should be a smoother transition. You know, I'm, I'm going to go ahead and do, I'm going to go ahead and say something, right? Here, you know, say something. I think they need to get, I think they need to get my boy right here on the, on the staff. You know, they got to get my boy on the I staff. Because I, I just really think that, being successful in college basketball is different than it was 30 years ago. Right. You got to be able to relate to the kids. You right. got to get somebody that understands what's going on on Instagram, what's going on in a, in a Jeezy versus Gucci Mane battle. Like, it might not mean anything to, to some people, but that That's means right. a lot when you're trying to recruit a kid from, from the heart of Chicago. You know what I'm saying? Right. <laughs> So, like, you got to know what's TikTok, what's pop, like, all that stuff. And I think that that's where I think you would be great on the staff. I think you would be an excellent recruiter. So, you, so I think that that's key is figuring out who's going to be the next head coach when Roy steps down and how does the staff continue to fill out. And how do we get – how do we, you know, stay current with these young guys, man? Make sure that, make sure that we pop them. We got to be the popping school.